The short answer is yes. To make sure that an accused party's interests are protected, everything should be recorded and documented. Granted, certain conversations and negotiations may have to take place, say, in a different capacity. A negotiation, say, as a case is being addressed, be it with the Title IX office, the uh, Student Conduct Office, the school's Office of General Counsel, the school's attorney, that is, or whomever else may be involved. But because so much is at stake and because you cannot depend on the school to be looking out for the accused party's interests when they're involved with a, a college sexual misconduct case, it is important that everything be documented, say, by email or otherwise, so that there is a record as to everything that took place from the start of the case until its conclusion, uh, in case further action hopefully would not need to be taken, but in some instances, regrettably, that may have to be the case. An experienced attorney advisor can help protect a person's interest throughout the process and should be involved from step one.